Okay, everybody, today is the big day. Shane is making his return to YouTube. I'm so scared. Now, <laughs> we have, what, T minus 47 minutes before the video goes live. So we're going to revisit the alpacas that made us very happy. I am such a, literally crying. I'm such a mess. I don't know, I'm scared, but I'm excited. So it's hours and hours later and I got one in my purse. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that is. I'm back. A lot. Look at, okay, since we've gotten our outfits, it's our first time on the town with our purses. Okay, you need to be honest though. What? Oh no. So I was going out alone and I got nervous and I was wearing my backpack and Shane goes, where's your purse? And I was like, well, I can't wear the purse alone. It's like, I can vlog in public alone, but wearing a purse in public alone, I'm not there yet. So now that Shane's accompanying me to run some errands, I got my purse. So I and listen, I am not a confident person, but I am confident in my, uh, you know, ability to be tacky and not care. And so when I saw your purse after I got it for you, I was like, wait, I need one. I, it's so cute. I'm a purse person now. And then I saw that they made bigger ones. And I was like, this is perfect. It can, it just rests right here. I just go in there, I get my chapstick. Like I don't, I don't consider it a purse. I consider it. A messenger bag, a gay <laughs> symbol. No, I consider it a, uh, um, It's a purse, but honestly, I don't care. Like, I'm, I'm living my life now authentically myself. I'm not trying to conform. I have a purse and that is what it is. And I'm trying to get to that level. I am bringing mine now. And for the first time ever, I'm going to drive Shane's new car. It's a truck. Okay, truck. Are see, right? see that, that's what I did. I have a purse, but I also have a truck. <laughs> So like, it's like I'm combining. <laughs> okay, well I have a purse and a G-Wagon, so it's <laughs> like, I'm just the worst. <sighs> Let's oh, go. Oh, I love it. Look at this fall ass day in Colorado. It's about to rain. Okay, so I have my purse nicely snuggling on my lap. And then I look over. What? Mine is back I'm on the floor. I'm driving. On the floor? You want me to have it nestled up to me while yes. I'm driving the whole time? Did you show <laughs> them it's gonna rain? Look how pretty it is. See, when we're done finishing the house, this is what you get. Purse, <laughs> purse vlogs. Well, what do we have left on the house? Oh, well, because lots. I didn't tell you. <gasps> I forgot to tell you. What? Well, look at the road. Oh, okay. Arvin DM me and he said, oh my God, I would love to come to Colorado. You're kidding me. Yeah, he's coming. Uh, I don't know when, but he's coming. Well, we need a second. We're not ready for him. We have to prepare. Well, you already got a purse, <laughs> so you're close. No, my office, our bedroom, our guest bedroom, the barn, there's a lot that needs to be decorated and designed. But first, Kazi. <laughs> <laughs> He's embarrassed. Of course I am. But didn't she just say, I like your bags? Yeah, but we're like matching in them. It's embarrassing almost. <laughs> like for two people to be wearing the same bags and say it looks like we've lost our minds. And there's that for you. Thank you very Thank much. You. Okay, we found a pumpkin patch, our local pumpkin patch. We're looking for hay barrels and real pumpkins, but for decoration. I just want to say there's nothing more fall girl than taking one of my pills and taking it down with the pumpkin spice latte. <laughs> well, this is actually a pumpkin spice freeze. Mm. Delicious. I'm, oh my God. <laughs> What is Colorado doing to my wig? <laughs> <laughs> so it's not a wig, by the way. We're at the pumpkin patch, and we saw that there was a corn maze. 
So we were like, uh, okay, yes, please. And I've never been, I've always wanted to be in a cornfield. I know that's weird, but I've just never done it. Like signs, like all the movies, there's a cornfield and it's creepy and I've never been in one. Never? Hold on, let me flip Wait. this around. Okay. What? Well, what is this? Like, what is this? You go in the entrance right here and then it's just like a never ending maze. And so like, once you're in, you just have to like keep going until you find your way out. I don't want to do this. <laughs> that sounds awful, kind of. No. But, like, it's fun, right? Well, I don't know the difficulty level of this. And There's... then if I get really scared, can I just, like, run through the corn? Or are they going to charge well, me for corn? No, you can't, like, break down the corn <laughs> unless you, like, shimmy through it. Uh, see? So you just, like, they have walkways through the oh, corn. right here. I can have a map of the corn. No! Oh, my gosh. Well, just in case. No, just absolutely in case. not. Just in case. No, no, no. Wow, I didn't know you're such a corn enthusiast. <laughs> well, yeah. I want to, like, have an authentic experience. So there's no scary people? No, corn mazes are more so just, like, a walking experience. <gasps> wow. That's there's, pretty scary. There's actually. legit corn. Okay, I'm going to see how fast I can do it because I'm going to follow all my gut instincts because I think I'm psychic and I want to see like if I am. Okay, let's see. Ow! Oh! We're already at a dead end. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we already failed. Gut instincts didn't work. Well, no. Let's see. Wait, this is actually giving me a panic. This is like Ikea. I'm getting an anxiety attack. <laughs> oh my gosh, so now there's a fork in the road. You gotta go left or right. Right. Okay. Wait, my gut's saying left though. Oh. My gut has been wrong before. Uh -huh. Hi. <laughs> Wait, what oh are those? Oh my god, hi. He's talking to me. God. Wait, come back, come here. Look at there's horses back oh, there. Where are we? Oh my god, the chickens. Are those turkeys? What are those? Hey! Is this part of the maze? No, <laughs> this is part of the farm though, the family that owns this. Okay, we found out they have a petting zoo. I'm so happy. Oh you're kidding me. Oh, look at the goats! Look how happy they are, Monkey. Oh my god, also it's blue thing. Oh, Shane. Hi. Hi. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No, no, it's okay. He's fine. Here, do you want some food? Okay, let me feed you. Hi. Hi. This oh, one jumps up for okay. food. Hi. Oh my god. Look how cute. Look at him. Look at him. Hi. Oh my gosh. What sound was that? Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh, hi! You need to let your brother have some. <laughs> <laughs> They're so cute. Wait, come here. Come here. Hey, we'll feed you too. Here, hold on. Hi! Oh. Okay. Oh, this is crazy. <laughs> this is insane. Okay, okay, all right. You've already had a lot. Like, now, I don't want to trigger you, but like, who are you? What about them? What about you? Okay. Hi. Oh my God, I want you. And don't worry guys, they have a whole pasture that they live on. This, they're only in that for a few hours for the petting zoo. Oh my God. Hi baby. You look like my couch. <laughs> They're literally still looking at us. Well, they were. <laughs> oh, now he is. Oh my God. Wait, we need alpacas, right? Yeah, I mean, they're very cute. They're just like- I feel like you don't like them anymore. I do like them. I'm just trying to figure out what you do with them and if they like will coexist with our dogs. That's something I need to look I into. I mean, I don't think you bring them in the house. Well, no, of course not. And then you shave them once a year, <laughs> which is perfect. So I'll get another bag. <laughs> Wait, come on, let's get them. I mean, we can't just get those ones. <laughs> and we need to fence in like a proper area for them. And they don't scream like the goats. No. But they do spit. 
That is so cute. When I was like trying to feed the one that was like less aggressive, the one that wanted to eat more was like <laughs> spitting at me, like projectiles <laughs> spitting at me. Yeah, he knows what he wants. <laughs> yeah, food. That's you. All right, we've got some decorations for outside of the barn, outside of the front door. Cute. I'm getting my own pack of food. <laughs> All right, first time getting the truck a little messy. <laughs> Okay, so we've already named the alpacas we don't I'm gonna, have. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start crying. I'm literally tearing up. I want alpacas so bad. Looking at them, like I was having kind of an anxious day and just being in their presence filled me with love. Like I'm so, we're gonna die right now, sorry. <laughs> Yikes, soccer mom. Like my heart. So, okay, here's the name idea. Your wig is nuts. <laughs> here's what I think the name should be. I think we should have a white one named Boucle. Boucle, and then the brown, light brown one named Teddy. Like Teddy Tablet. Teddy and Boucle. Teddy I and mean... Boucle, that is so cute. Sound off in the comments below. So I'm gonna go home and do some research. It seems like, uh, yeah, right. It seems like they're uh, pretty easy to maintain and we already have the barn and they like to eat native grass, which our whole property is full of, so. Oh my God, and every year you shear them, their fur, so we can do a giveaway. <laughs> Just our Colorado life. All right, so the first one is gonna be back here. That is so cute. And we can even stack these kind of like that. Oh, uh, mm. <laughs> Don't like it? Well, I think, I like the big ones on the sides. Hmm. Mm -mm. Oh no. <laughs> oh God, what do we do? Should the scarecrow be up right there? Oh, sitting next to the hay? God, why is he so heavy? Oh my God. He's really heavy. Wait, how do we get him out of here? <laughs> <laughs> this is what it's gonna be like if I die and you have to like <laughs> get my body to the hospital. Wait, why is he so heavy? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh my god. Come on, mister. Wow. This is like the people propping me up at VidCon. <laughs> is this like super trashy to have him out here? No, this is so cute. What do you mean? I gotta go get his other arm. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, I've got it plugged in. And he's blowing up, decorating for Halloween is in full effect. Oh my God. Come on up, baby. Oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> oh my God. His wig is a little spermy, but it's cute. Come look what's in my freezer, mom. I have Kraft macaroni and cheese ice cream and pumpkin that spice twinkie. Gross. That would be horrible. Well, we've got to try it today. They actually sent it to us, so. Really? Yeah. Oh, oh what a mistake that might be. <laughs> I have had actual oh. nightmares, recurring nightmares of being in a frozen yogurt shop and the flavors are cheese, nacho, burrito. Oh I don't, they said this is their most popular and it sells out frequently. They're lying. It's like <laughs> they're insane. lying. That is Right well, there. What about the pumpkin spice Twinkie? That you can take one out of the box. I, I, mean, I, I got that for. <laughs> also, your mom was asking for ice for her coffee, and we don't have an ice maker here. So watch what we have. So we have these shot glasses. Oh. All right. So let's see. If, oh let's man. See if I can get it out better. How did I help last time? It didn't seem like <laughs> this. Yeah, oh, yeah. this one. Okay, red. This is what we did. Oh. Oh. <laughs> God. This is the weirdest thing. <laughs> what's, what's wrong? What is this? I literally switched what? today because I was too embarrassed without shame. I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm embarrassed to carry that. He's embarrassed to have a purse. Why? Are you, are you, have you been wearing yours? Yeah. And I only wear it when I'm with Shane because I feel just like it's too much. So you, oh. you don't think so, this is like normal? <laughs> 
Okay, you've seen my purse, right? I go the smallest amount necessary to get the job done. So that is a lot of folk. <laughs> it's cute, Shane, but it's, a, let me go get my purse. <laughs> purse haul. This is Target, $17.99 or so. But see, it's small. Older. Yeah, but mm -hmm. see, like if see, you but went, Think about it this way. The bigger the purse, <laughs> the smaller the body. <laughs> <laughs> and then if my back is feeling fat, I switch it around. Oh, no back! <laughs> yeah. What? Wow, that actually looks really good with your outfit and Wait, everything. Okay, they should get this changed out to leather. <laughs> okay. I'll call Mark Jacobs. And I feel like that's hilarious. Oh. Yeah, I don't like the strap. I was embarrassed, yeah, this morning to do this I by myself. <laughs> I was embarrassed, yeah, this morning. I was, I got embarrassed, so I emptied it out and put it in something else. Okay, everybody, today is the big day that Shane is making his return to YouTube. I'm so scared. I don't want to, I want to, but I'm scared. Oh my god. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, whoa, I look nuts. Well, okay. Here's what's weird is I feel like you guys are like our family or something. Like it's a very different energy. And I almost feel like I am posting something on a channel that is going to get a lot of hate. Like I know I'm very aware of that. And I know it's gonna make me spiral and really sad and feel really depressed and then, but I'm gonna try not to. It almost feels like, like this is home. It feels like I am like going off to college or something, except that I'm gonna get uh, <gasps> literally murdered. <laughs> Like I'm going off to college knowing I'm gonna get into a car crash on the way to college. <laughs> but can I say part of what inspired me? Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say my office, but you too. No, you too, you too, you too. <laughs> Literally you, only you. But also my boob account. But also my office. Like decorating the office literally was game changing. Like it made me want to make something. Like I felt so comfortable lighting my candles. But, but that's not what this video is about. I think to get my mind off of it, oh my, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> like I feel like I'm gonna throw up, pass out and throw up. To get my mind off of it, maybe we should go try a new coffee place or buy more blankets or I, literally anything to get my mind off of um, everybody hating me. <laughs> Because wow. that's only an hour and a half away. Yeah, and it's unpredictable. That's what, it's like the unknown. It's like, it's either gonna go really bad, it's gonna go okay, or like- It's gonna go really bad. <sighs> I know that. I'm aware of that. I just hope people give it a chance and I hope they like it. If they're bored by it and they hate me, I'm, oh, I can't do that. <laughs> I feel so sick. I don't know what to do. Or, I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Uh, wish us luck and I guess we're gonna try to do something to cope with the nerves or anxiety or whatever this is. I mean, it's a very weird place to be. Uh... I did have a dream last night that this was Christmas Eve, that this was going live and then it like ruined Christmas, but thank God I woke up and it's not Christmas. <laughs> no, I'm just saying like- <laughs> It ruined Christmas? <laughs> well, I think even if the reaction is positive, it's going to be all encompassing for a second. But I think you and I are both better at like, not uh, letting external affect internal as much as it once did. I, okay, maybe, oops. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> I'm sorry, it was a demon. Oh my God. It was a demon, it was a demon. Okay, so we got coffee and now <laughs> we have what, T minus 47 minutes before the video oh goes live and we're going to revisit the alpacas that made us very happy the other day. Yeah, cause I was thinking, I'm like, okay, yes, we could go shopping, furniture shopping and stuff, but like what truly makes me so happy and forget about everything, alpacas. So, <laughs> so I feel a little better. I'm excited. I'm lying, I'm still scared, <laughs> but we're gonna see the alpacas and well, I have my, uh, my coffee. Yeah, okay. All right. We're back at our favorite place. I'm such a, literally crying. I'm such a mess. I don't know, I'm scared, but I'm excited. <gasps> There's the outback. Oh my God. Reunited with our BFFs. Hi, babies. Oh, I love you so much. Hi. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Do you want to come home with us? <laughs> Are you guys excited about my video? <laughs> Okay, so it's hours and hours later, and... What? We're shook! I oh. mean, this has been, like, alarmingly positive, don't you think? I mean, your mom said it best with, uh, <laughs> <laughs> with an emoji of her lighting up a big heart. I love it. Oh, gosh. I'm a mess. I don't know what to say. I'm overwhelmed, but, um... I feel weird. I don't know what to say. Oh, I know what I want to say, but is it weird that I'm talking to the vlog? I guess I talked earlier. I'm so out of it. I've been crying all day. <laughs> I can't believe that people are being nice. Like, I wasn't going to read the comments at all. Like, you know, I was not going to read the comments. And then you were like, the comments are really nice. And I was like, there's no way. And then I looked and I've been crying all day. I literally thought... It's over. I'm gonna get canceled again. Thank God I woke up and it's not Christmas. I'm gonna have a small amount of people that still fuck with me and then like everybody else is gonna hate me and they're gonna hate me, hate me, hate me, hate me, hate me. Which they still probably do, but like I've never seen positive comments before in like two years. <laughs> so like I was not expecting like, yeah, I just can't believe it. Yeah, I mean, it's a big deal. We were preparing for the worst, like wave two, like, you know. Here's what I was afraid about. I was afraid, because we've come so far, I've come so far, I'm in such a good place, I was afraid of ruining it. Like, oh, if I post a video, I'm entering back into the lion's den, I'm gonna ruin everything, it's gonna ruin my life again, I'm gonna be so sad, uh, you're gonna have to retire because everybody's gonna hate you for being with me. Like, I just kind of was going through all that, so this is not what I was expecting, so thank you guys so much. So, I'm just, sorry. I'm, 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 thank you guys so much. <laughs> No, it truly is just incredible, and yeah, I mean... <sighs> and I promise part two and three are so much better than part one. <laughs> like, they're so much better. Like, I was so scared also, because I was like, it's, is it boring? Like, it's part two and three. Hold on to your asses. Hold on to... I'll hold on to my fat ass. You hold on to yours, bitch. We're on the ride. Yes! I'm so excited. Like, I'm not excited. I'm exci Obviously, I'm excited that people are being nice, but I'm more excited that I get to post and make crazy shit again. Like, I want to make crazy, fucked up, crazy shit. And, like, peep... And, and scary shit. Like, I'm just so excited to do stuff. Yeah. I mean, I think it's freeing for you to be able to be able to create again. When we came to this new house, we felt like this rebirthing of just, like, energy and life and fun. And I think part of the scary portion of posting again, it's, like, going into the wild and the unknown. We didn't know it was going to happen. And... We didn't want that to taint this house or our experiences yeah. here or like have a like round two of like everything that went down in this new space as well that would make us hate it. Well, and that's the thing too. It's like, because I really do mean when I say I don't care what people think anymore, I really mean it. Like I don't. Which also though, I can't buy into all the positive either because I appreciate it. But like, you know, people can turn, things can change. Like, so I can't be like, oh my God, people like me now because... That's not real. I mean, it's real, but it's not. You know what I mean? I don't know. It's a healthy way to look at it, right? Like, I'm trying not to take it in and, as fact. Well, more importantly, I did, like, because we left the house to get our minds off of it, which turned into us going to a furniture store, which turned into me buying another boucle piece of furniture that doesn't work anywhere in our house, which I knew that was going to happen, but I still wanted it. But I feel like now this chair represents, like... A new beginning. Yeah. <laughs> this isn't where all the furniture is, but this is where- Oh, Cheeto has to check it out, like always. I mean, look how beautiful this chair is. The black, it matches our house, the black accents, the boucle seat, the boucle back. Like, how do we not have a place for it in our house? Cheeto, do you like it? Cheeto, literally, every time we get a new piece of furniture, he has to, like, inspect it, lay on it, break it in. I Please. also should see, when we were at the furniture store, I DM'd Arvin because you didn't want the chairs. And I was like, hey, can you convince Ryland to buy these chairs with me? <gasps> oh my God, he wrote back. He said, oh my God, I hope you got those. The fabric and the black wood combo is stunning. You'll find a place for them. And he put heart eye emojis. Well, I got them. <laughs> and I don't have a place for them.
<laughs> but we ordered cookies, we're gonna celebrate, we're gonna have a good night, and yeah. Why does this look like me? Uh -huh. What is this? It, he even has my fat ass. <laughs> oh, sorry, it's just children. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we have a problem. I'm so excited! <laughs> no. So we were having a great time. Okay, okay. I'm so excited. We were having a great time Christmas shopping. So Shane said, oh, let's go to our favorite little like gift specialty boutique store and see what they have going on. And they have... Oh my God. I, I can't believe this is happening. I haven't decided if I wanted him though. Like where are uh, you thinking he's gonna go? It's so crazy because I don't care. <laughs> wow, this is the best day of my life. I didn't think it could get better. And it just got better. Hmm. It does get better. Wow, I never believed that. 